All right, so that video cut off. Let's continue. Impress upon the subconscious what you want it to do for you. It's your genie, if you will. You are the divine. You are the drop that is in the ocean. You are a part of source. So therefore you have the ability to desire, to create, to co-create, use it. And the last part, this is the darkness before the dawn. Have you ever heard of the darkness being biggest right before the brightest, best day? It happens, y'all. Think about the patterns on earth. There's so many things that happen repetitiously that you can, you can plan for it a lot of times, unless you're dealing with someone who understands themselves to be awakening spiritually, remembering who they are. Most people are in trance most of the day, in and out of it. And that's why the battle, there is the battle to take control of your mind. So no wonder many of you feel sad and all this kind of stuff. And I felt it too depression, anxiety, um, unworthiness, um, sadness, guilt, uh, bird, feeling heavy burden. A lot of the heavy burden energy is being lifted. But right now it looks like your cards are all down. You don't have any options. That is not what it really is. You've been planting the seeds. You've been doing that. You have been planting the seeds act as if it's done that is the trick that is the extra element you've got to act as if you have it so there is a very practical thing you can do because i know a lot of you are listening are star seeds intuitives empaths and you're feeling so much and you feel so heavy i trust me i know man oh my god <laughs> um but even if you can't journal right now or you don't have the energy to journal, like I said, clap, get your energy together, dance, do something that gets you moving. Just do something small. Even if it's pick a piece of paper up off the floor that has been sitting there collecting dust that you haven't picked up because you feel blocked and limited. Expand yourself now. That's what this video is for right here is to tell you to stand up, shake it off, shake it off and literally see yourself doing it if visualization is an issue write down the practical list that's micro journaling i'll do a video on that but just write a list of some steps right now something you can do just to take one little step even if it's just to get to the door even if it's just to get a cup of water you have to believe me that there is a time when things are not gonna keep rolling. Sometimes the river and the ocean are still. There's always movement, but sometimes it moves slower than other times. Manifestation happens in stages. And the next moon we have is definitely a new moon, Mercury retrograde going on. So you know, and Saturn being retrograde for like the next four months, you have to look at the structure right now. That's what's being asked structure one more of these one more i'm gonna pull out my bag this is wax on the side it's been on my shrine but let me pull one more for guidance last message for you star seeds is this this is the lightning bolt <laughs> it's telling you use that energy and literally just scatter this all this bs that looks like it's in your way and you feel like you can't get moving you're almost there. You're facing forward. You've got a pathway in front of you. What is on your list? In the past videos, we talked about writing down lists. Whatever sort of list you're writing down in the comments, y'all, I want you to let me know how you have been keeping track of your progress spiritually and how is it working for you as far as getting towards your goals, going towards your goals. What's your main problem? What, what really is the main thing that you would say is limiting or, you know, blocking or stopping you from taking the next step or action? 
or feeling like you can break free right now. Remember that what comes to you by divine right does so based on your perfect exchanging with another. Because each of us is a teacher to the other, you know it. But remember to say that you're receiving perfect, 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 perfect service. And you're also receiving the perfect payment for the service that you're providing for someone. If you are an empath, if you're a healer, if you're someone who provides services for somebody and you are always giving, 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 remember to say that what comes to me by divine right does so based on perfect service and I am receiving perfect pay. And remember to repeat it several times a day. And once you do this, you can show others how to do it. You all are the teachers that are, t that are learning how to turn this energy over and to work it. You've got to act as if. That is the reading. My name is Queen Sarita, your host. And I'll be back with another video. The website's naturallyhighlife.com. On Instagram is queen underscore Sarita. It's been a pleasure channeling for you the message from Soba. They say that there's one more after this one.